And welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am the Red Terran in the Southeast, up against Bloof. It's a good name, Bloof. Uh, the Blue Zerg in the Northwest. The map is Jungle Basin. I finally learned the name of this map as well. Good lord, how long did it take? Anyways, uh, Supply Depot going down for me. Same time, his Overlord is coming out, so a uh, pretty similar build from us. Uh, he is just now setting his hotkey, uh, putting that to 3. I put my command center to 4. Um, my drone, or uh, my SCV going out uh, for some scouting. As his drone goes out for some scouting, uh, we go on the opposite side, so we will not be seeing each other. Barracks going down for me, but no spawning pool from... Bloof, and I, that was bad on my part. I, I sh saw that drone, but I didn't go over in time to stop the hatchery. That, If I had stopped that hatchery, it would have so thrown him off the game. I'm so upset at myself, I just tried to drill the living hell out of that hatchery, as if that's going to do anything. Uh, he does send four drones off to try to end my harassment. Um, but when, that, uh, when I get out, uh, he puts them back. So I, even though I didn't... Uh, you know, spot anything out of the ordinary, you know, the, the fast hatchery is pretty common these days now that Terran uh, can't do that fast Reaper harass, or at least not as fast as they used to, you know, that extra 10 seconds for two uh, Reapers really does uh, add up. Um, but I did scare him enough into getting spine crawlers. You know, I do take a slight lead in the harvester count. Um, he is getting, looks like, six zerglings. Um, I only have three marines out myself. Two barracks, three barracks uh, going down for me. Pretty standard for me. I don't clump them up like I wish I did. You know, I want to put them in a line here and make it a little, uh, little easier to, to navigate through. Factory going down for me. Are we going to be seeing Hellions for me this game? No, I'm a noob, dude. I don't know about the Hellions. And another spine crawler. So four spine crawlers and only six zerglings. I mean, I have to assume that he's going for some uh, tech here. Oh my gosh, look at that lag. What is going on? It's been really, I swear it's not me. It is StarCraft 2 since the patch. It's been it's been insane. If I look at my old replays and I record those, no problems whatsoever. And a spire going down, an early spire uh, going down for Bloof. Um, as he sends his overlords out to, to make sure I don't get any scouting done. But of course, not in the one spot that I would go. Uh, but anyway, since the patch, um, there has been quite a problem lately. And I scan, I don't see any tech. Um, I, I see those spine crawlers, but as that should have told me uh, that I, I should go in for the attack. I uh, get some more marauders and go in. Uh, but it doesn't tell me that. It tells me nothing. I should, in fact, be moving out with this. But I send my marines out to take out this overlord. Good lord, what is with the sound? Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so, yeah, back to StarCraft 2. Since the patch, lots of people have been reporting that they have lots of problems with the patch, and it doesn't seem like that um, Blizzard is doing anything, at least right now, to take care of it. Um, at least not the time that I'm recording this. Um, it has been at least a week since the patch came out. Maybe even two weeks, and... All these problems are coming up. Uh, the graphics uh, that I talked about in my last um, in my last video that was a big problem. It, it made the game unplayable for me for a while. Um, I, I did play about seven or eight games um, with it. Uh, this was one of them. Um, but I, now the the sound is absolutely terrible. Um, hold on, let's see if I can try to fix it in game. Give me a second. Alright, I did turn the sound quality down, so hopefully that will fix the problem. It does sound like it did. Um, I, I mean, I'm I'm on low for everything. This is, I mean, I'm on a laptop, but it's a new laptop. It should be able to handle this stuff fine. I'm playing other games. It doesn't have this problem. Just as I send my army out, 
bad timing. Mutas are up. I should have missile turrets up, and I'm just now building them, and it's far too late. Um, I've found that uh, the best third players will have those uh, mutas up at about the nine, nine and a half minutes mark, so you want those missile turrets up by then. I, of course, did not, uh, and this is going to be a huge setback for me. Looking at the income tab, I am down to 25 harvesters and letting them take a big lead in income, and that is going to, uh, I mean, it's not going to win the game for him, but it's definitely going to help, you know what I mean? Taking out, uh, if I had had those missile turrets up here, 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 all around the back, um, all the way to here, it would have been so different of a game. But I am stuck on this one base here for now as he continues to mass mutas. Um, as he's getting upgrades for him, I don't know what that is. That's, oh my goodness, he's already got one one upgrades. Uh, no, he's just getting armor on him. He's not getting attack. Uh, I've never quite seen uh, so heavy on armor, but consider that might be why these missile ships are having such a hard time with these mutas. And the <laughs> no, that they're not going anywhere. They're finally moving out. Uh, Marines just heading out. Not sending the Marauders to die, although they could tank a little bit. And that orbital command is going to go down. So I am absolutely screwed. He's down to t he's up on two base. I'm stuck on my on my one. He didn't even need to expand creep past this one creep tumor. So I figure I have no choice. I've got to make a move here. So I go for a push. Uh, knowing that it's probably going to be the end of the game for me, uh, but it's the only choice I have left. Reactor going down. I am supply locked uh, thanks to him taking out that uh, command center. Um, but, uh, yes, yeah, so you see the Marines here. They're absolutely useless here. There's... <laughs> Uh, there's no reason for them to be there, so I finally do move them out. But the SUVs can go right through them because they are in so-called harvest mode. And then, wow, uh, the second uh, upgrade is not up, but the armor is up. Uh, the first armor, so I have no chance here. And down goes the rest of the army. I should have GG just right there, um, but I did want to make them work because I did so badly such stupid things I did and I'm still massing marauders look at all those marauders oh my gosh what are they good for absolutely nothing and he comes in one of the few places I don't have a missile turret and takes out the starport right as I'm trying to get more vikings out and uh, <laughs> trying to expand back into my main base and it's not helping it's not up yet missile turrets up they're not going to do anything Marauders, uh, Marines getting slaughtered, Marauders getting slaughtered. And this is my one mining base. Um, I'm not getting any gas, but as you can see, I've got a ton of gas left over. But nothing to counter these mutas. And they're just having their way in my base, taking out the tech lab. I'm not sure why they took out the tech lab there. I'm s trying to get an armory down so I can get Thors out. Uh, but it's going to be far too late for that. I mean, look at all that. 22 mutas with a with an armor upgrade. Just no chance. 36 harvesters against my 18. He's literally got double what I have. He's going for my only mining base here, and he will take that out easily, so I am forced to leave. Uh, so good game from Bloof. Uh, his strategy worked well when he saw that I wasn't going to attack um, after he laid down those first four spine colors, a little panicky at the beginning, but he quickly switched and went for the tech upgrades, and that is what won him the game because I did not attack. I was ahead for so much of the game, but I just didn't take advantage of it. You've got to put pressure on Zerg, otherwise they will do this to you every time. So I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Bye.